This is a video of the Ariex Turbo X world's fastest quadcopter and the Hubson Q4H11 quadcopter. Now they're both almost the same size and I'm just making this video to show the Hubson Q4 is actually as quick as the uh, Turbo X. It has more tilt than the Turbo X even in its Turbo X mode. But the motors might be faster in the Ariex Turbo X. It's hard to say here. And I'm going to go start with the uh, Ariex Turbo X and go through the modes and show the tilt on here. This is mode one, nice and tame. Mode 2 has a lot more tilt. And mode 3, which is Turbo X. This has the most tilt. And it's pretty fast, as you can see. I'm just trying different heights and angles here so you can see the tilting. Okay, that's it for the Turbo X. Next is the Hobson. Q4. You can hear the motors are slower. There we go. That's mode one, tilt. Mode 2. This is mode 3. Now this has extreme tilting on here. It's highly responsive as you can see. Definitely has way more tilt than the Turbo X. It's quite a bit. That's quite fast as you can see. And my low voltage lights are coming on. Even though this is 100% charged, it's time for a new battery. Alright, I better land here before the low voltage cutoff kicks in. Here are the yaw rates on the quadcopters. The first one is the Turbo X. That's it. That's as fast as it'll go. First one was mode. One, this is mode two, yaw rates. This is mode three, yaw rates. So as you see, the yaw rate is pretty slow. Let me bring it back here. This is hard to do because I'm standing behind the camera trying to watch 
the camera and fly at the same time. Okay, that's the yaw rate for the Turbo X. Now here are the, now here are the yaw rates for the Hubson. I'll start in mode one. Uh, on the Turbo X, you noticed, and I, what I think is the yaw rates stay the same in all three modes. They don't change. If they do, it's so subtle, you, I can't tell. Now, on the Hudson, they change quite a bit, uh, very dramatically, in fact. Okay, I'm in the first mode. That's pretty much similar to the Turbo X, speed-wise. Let me try to bring it closer. Now mode 2 gets quite a bit faster. That's full speed on the uh, off, full stick. Okay, here's mode three. Now this one is very fast. This has the fastest yaw rate on any size quadcopter the size that I've ever seen or tried or had. I mean, that's crazy fast. Okay, that's it. That's the all rated the two quadcopters. And I just ordered a new battery for the Hopson because the battery's bad. As you can see from the short flight times. I believe the slow yaw rate on the Turbo X is because when you're going at extreme speeds, anything quicker would be really hard to control. So that's most likely why they did that. Um, that's it.